as with everything that we did throughout the COP process, there's a lot of thought that goes into the themes that are selected. With the aim, of course, of being inclusive, we as a COP presidency had a number of thematics that were the first time ever at COP to be fully representative and inclusive in terms of the different areas that we were focusing on. We need a different mindset to fix the fundamental challenge of making climate finance more available, more accessible, and more affordable. Food is central to every culture, to every community. This is the first ever food day in the 28 years of history at COP. Our strategy is to decarbonize the energy system of today while investing in the energies of uh, tomorrow. At this COP, it's vitally important that we carry the focus on health all the way into and through the negotiations. This is the first time that COP had this amount of youth involved and included. At COP28, we are anchoring nature as an existential ally to address climate change and advance development. Indigenous people are the first peoples. And we protect 80% of the forest. Oceans meets climate, that's the conversation we want to begin at the COP. Welcome to Cities Day here at COP28. Cities, states, provinces and regions representing here. A huge thank you to the COP28 presidency who brought us together in an unprecedented way. We must recognize the common language we must speak of and it's one of unity, of inclusion, love and empowerment.